Um, oh, just this um, further clarification of Vatican II. So that, that's where the abominations come in, isn't it? Yeah. Well, that's how they got into Rome, and that's what the faithful of Rome have been saying. That's why there's this schism, and the likes of Mel Gibson's father has been objected. That that was the door that opened it to the Jews. So what I didn't For know this. Jews, what's this Christ, about Mel Gibson's father? Well, well he's a, he's a, 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 a true Catholic apologetic, if you like. Ah, oh, okay. And he spent his life going through. Vatican I, and he's, he's a, an academic, an intellect. Mm. And he and men like him have pulled to pieces Vatican II and says, this is where the devil has got him. Forgiveness of the Jews? Well, what has Yah been saying? There is no forgiveness. They knew exactly what they were doing. Mm -hmm. But because of tolerance, if you like, and, and the uh, God is, well, yes, he is love, but forgive them all, they know not what they're doing, they have taken advantage of it to infiltrate the Church of Rome to have their way with all these abominations as by, per the Talmud. Mm. So that's the abomination of desolation standing up in the holy place. It's the Talmud standing up in the, in the temple, which is the earth, and every, everything goes, everything goes through religious tolerance. Mm. Hello? No. It's a narrow way. He paid the price for all, unless you enter through him. And that means now he is the door to the Father because he is the Father in his flesh body. Now all must go to him as the entry into paradise, which is lived out upon the earth to all those who bow to his authority. So, as he said, the Jews are on really thin ice. protocols of Zion their intention has been all along mm. knowing exactly what they do because they do not count themselves as human that is with a soul they believe that once they are dead it's all over yep it's all about this material it's all world. about this material world to serve them and their lust for money the root of all evil so all of those ones who have stood up and said Vatican has opened it well they were right Mm. Innocent men like um, Benedict have been caught up in their wanting religious tolerance, which is, that will come once the Christ is in his position. And only then. Because mm -hmm. until then, every abomination has been allowed in. And the soul, the soul who's being told, well, it's okay, there are many roads to Rome, if you like, or many roads into heaven. What good is it allowing that soul to go in along, believing that's so? It's not. It is not so. He is the door. He always was and he always is. And the cross is the centre of all of the universe. You cannot escape the cross. So once he is in that position as the head of the church that he's been born back into to take over for this purpose now a billion man army if you like of souls recognizing the king the christ who is the true pontiff he owns he owns it all it's all his mm. it's all based on him and it totally he did it all so once he is in position then the tolerance will come only on his word. Not any man thinking they are speaking through the Holy Spirit. Because I tell you what, the Holy Spirit that people have been hearing now for centuries has been a lying spirit. Adam was lied to over and over and over and over again by the devil who presents himself as apparitions in any form that it could think up. Adam was deceived. Yet God rescued him over and over and over. You fell for it again. You fell for it again. Did I not tell you? Did I not tell you this? So the devil comes along and starts whispering other things and makes it look all nice and acceptable and all lovey-dovey and all the rest of it. But did I not? God. Adam died several times. 
he sent his word, an angel, holy angel, to resurrect him several times because Adam was fooled over and over and over again. That's why he had to come. Go to the cross, as this, well, they call him the second Adam, this time being obedient to his own word and to suffer everything that Adam went through, showing that all it takes is obedience to my word. Don't touch. That was really it. That was the one simple instruction Adam was given. Don't touch. Didn't last one hour. So men, Adam caused the fall. So, you know, no way has that. There is no tolerance until the Christ is in his position to make the judgment of what he allows to continue in the kingdom of God that is to protect all children of the future from the abominations that have been allowed to go rampant by adults who think that God is tolerant. Where's the love in that? You hit the nail on the head days ago when you said, well, you had to come to the realisation that to allow these things to go on, repeat over and over and over, there has to be a cutoff point. Well, that's it. It's called the end of times. Everybody's being given opportunity to get it right. So there is no tolerance, especially regarding the Jews, at this point. When the announcement is made that he is back and he has being recognised by all nations on the earth, and they do bow to him, then the tolerance is decided by himself. How much he will allow? So, yes, not a lot, a rod of iron. What is a rod of iron? It doesn't bend. So let's get it all very clear right now so there is no confusion or double speak or subterfuge language or allowance for any crooked ways to continue. Vatican II opened the door to the Jew who set out from the beginning to destroy not only the church but all of the earth, all of God's creation. Now, there is forgiveness for those who repent, understanding the error of their ways. Not so for those who do not repent. And that comes after the announcement. Enoch, the judgment of Enoch. Enoch was shown both judgments. That's the script we are following. The Bible has been orchestrated to suit the Jews, the ones that are in Israel right now. We are God's chosen people, slaughtering, decapitating all Talmud, decapitating children, or causing the children to decapitate their own parents. Now, regarding the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I'll tell you straight, the apparitions that have been happening around the earth, we've already made the announcement, they are a con. Why? Because it's got everybody looking up at this apparition, worshipping Mary. Yes, she is the Holy Mother. Of course she is. However, Mary's heart is operating. And I don't even know that it was actually Mary's heart operate. It's operating here right now as you are hearing these words. It's operating through me and all those who are with us here right now who think like me. Andrea, the courage of a lion to do what she did to get through to a man who is being put in a position by other men when protocol would stop her at the gate. 
She felt like she was David facing Goliath, and she certainly was. The Christ has no tolerance for men who would instruct women who were his ministry the first time around. Women will become priests, not only within the church, priestesses, whatever you like, ministers. They have always been the ministers. They have been shut down. They have been told not to speak in public. They have been made to serve men who are totally evil because the devil Paul said so. Rome was built on the teachings of Paul. He was the devil that as Jesus he warned would come after him. Adam was the cause of the fall of man, not Eve. She was innocent. So all the patriarchal religions that have grown up, and, and, and they all are, have held Eve accountable for what Adam did. Well, the Christ is releasing his wife, the nuns, the women who care for the sick, the elderly, the children, nurture, raise them up, love them, give their lives for them, and a lot of the time with no thanks even from their own children. So with that being said, setting the record straight, making straight the crooked places. It's all ending. So, anything else? The right thing has no choice. He's one of the only living ones out of the seven That's right. of the prophecy of Revelation 7 and 11. He asked me who's going to be the next Pope. Well, you are. Can't because the church won't let me. It says, My church, I'll let you. That's it. I'll we'll sort him out. <laughs> okay, now with that, I'll continue editing. <laughs>